the question is there are 80 coins among them one coin weighs less compared to the others you are given a physical balance to weigh in how many weighing the odd can can be found in how many weighing can the odd can be found see there are totally 80 coins are given to you of which one coin is weighing less a physical balance is also given you will have to find out in how many attempts can you tell that this is the coin that is weighing uh, wrong so I have been getting multiple answers for this first I will give a way of working so divide the coins by 2 divide the coins by 2 40 40 divide the coins by 2 it will be 40 40 see what happens is when to the 2 40 are weighing one coin that is weighing less will automatically go up we don't have any ways to measure so 40 here 40 coins here so one coin that is weighing less will automatically go up so this 40 is having the defective coin this 40 will be the coin that is going up 40 coins will be going up that will have the defective coin divide that 40 by 2 divide the 40 by 2 20 20 so again one of these 20 will be wrong divide it by 2 10 10 one of these 10 will be wrong then 5 5 one of these 5 will be wrong 2 2 and 1 always keep on dividing by 2 till what happens is in case both these 2 are equal when I weigh 2 2 so it is equal so the defective is here but you cannot give the answer as 5 because you are not sure it is here or not so you will have to go one more step don't give the answer as 5 here 1 and 1 now this is the way for explaining because I want to understand it first dividing the coins what exactly happens so dividing 40 40 I will get the answer in 6 attempts but the answer is not 6 don't give the answer as 6 don't give, get confused by my explaining this so divide I just wanted to understand that's the reason why I have done this by dividing what will happen now divide the coins by 3 so 80 divided by 3 will be 27 27 and 26 27 27 and 26 see when we weigh these two 27s what will happen is the one coin that is weighing less will automatically go up I have not touched the third 26 because the defective coin is here the third 26 will be right because the defective coin is here the third 26 will be right supposing both are equal so the defective coin will be in the 26 both are equal the defective coin will be in the third 26 so what happens here is I am weighing all the 80 coins here I am eliminating one third of the coins without weighing I weigh this two if it is here one will go up this is right if these are equal it is dead so here I am eliminating one third of the coins one third without weighing similarly I can do in one third at unless 127 will be wrong again divided by 3 9 9 9 one nine will be wrong divided by three 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 and one three will be wrong divided by three one 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 the answer is four see some students ask me class what happens if it is there in 26 so 127 is wrong divided by three one nine is wrong divided by three one three is wrong divided by three one 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 so what happens in 26 is only concept about weighing so take this because this 8 54 coins are take one from it and make it as 27 then keep on drawing it otherwise if you want to do it only with 26 so divide by 3, 9, 9, 8. If this 8 is wrong, divide by 3, 3, 3, 2. This one is wrong, this will be like this. So it will be 4. So it is nothing but you have to go by using power of 3. So anything above 27, your answer will be 4. Anything above 81, your answer will be 5 like that, it will go. Subscribe to my channel. I will be adding questions every now and then.